The version 3.5 update for Tesla Optimus represents a transformative leap, moving from a humanoid robot designed primarily for factories to becoming the living brain of the smart home. The breakthrough is not about performing a few clever movements, but about how Optimus integrates with the Internet of Things, learns and adapts to human habits, manages security proactively, supports elderly care, and sets the foundation for Tesla's future vision of fully integrated Tesla tiny homes. So, how does this latest update improve your home? Don't click away. In the next 30 seconds, I'll show you Tesla's most secret update about Optimus. Before we begin, if you love staying ahead on Tesla and AI tech, hit subscribe now, you'll be the first to know the breaking news. The backbone of this upgrade is connectivity. A typical household today has between 14 and 25 connected devices, ranging from lights, locks, air conditioners, and cameras to sensors and smart plugs. Optimus serves as both a participant and a coordinator, speaking the universal IoT languages while leveraging Wi-Fi 6-6E for high bandwidth needs. This ensures interoperability across brands and reduces latency between devices. The difference is crucial. A motion sensor triggering a camera and smart lock within 10 milliseconds can be the line between a timely alert and a missed intrusion. Tesla's architecture emphasizes on-device processing. Decisions such as unlocking the door for a recognized family member, switching off a stove when overheating is detected, or closing blinds under harsh sunlight all happen locally. Only anonymized summaries leave the home, maintaining privacy while optimizing performance. What makes Optimus powerful inside the smart home is not just communication, but context awareness. Unlike traditional if-this-then-that automation, Tesla Optimus employs probabilistic habit learning. It studies repetitive patterns such as wake-up times, lighting preferences, dinner schedules, or evening phone charging habits. Within two weeks, it begins suggesting routines with measurable savings. For example, combining occupancy data with calendar schedules can reduce air conditioning runtime by 30 to 40 percent per day, while still keeping wall surface temperatures within the comfort zone. For a household with three independent AC units, this translates to saving 140 kilowatt hours per month. In regions where electricity costs are high, this is a significant financial benefit. Beyond cost, habit learning optimizes everyday routines. Curtains open one-third at sunrise to prevent glare, coffee starts brewing when you enter the kitchen, and the water heater reaches your preferred temperature just in time for your shower. These small, precise interventions reduce morning tasks by half while retaining manual override through voice, gesture, or mobile application. Security is another domain where Optimus shines. Traditional smart cameras are notorious for false alarms from pets or tree shadows. V3.5 reduces these false positives by 60 to 80% in daylight and 40 to 60% at night by combining multimodal perception, video, audio, and vibration sensors. Its layered role-based access control ensures that locks only disengage when multiple factors, face, voice, and smartphone proximity, are confirmed. False unlocks are reduced to less than 0.1%. When suspicious movement lingers near the property, Optimus activates subtle deterrents like low-intensity lighting and records encrypted video clips. Importantly, Optimus explains alerts in natural language. Instead of just motion detected, it specifies adult-sized figure approaching front door from sidewalk at 1.2 meters per second without registered device. This level of transparency allows for faster, more accurate decision-making. In a 30-day field test with two dogs and a tree-filled yard, alerts were reduced from 100 to 38 with only four unnecessary notifications. Support for elderly residents is designed around safety, dignity, and privacy. Optimus tracks medication routines, hydration habits, and mobility patterns. Subtle interventions, like turning on anti-slip lights in a humid bathroom, happen proactively. Fall detection reaches over 95% accuracy with under 10 seconds delay for remote alerts. When physical support is needed, Optimus uses force-limited assistance, capped at 12% of maximum hand strength, with safety harnesses to prevent injury. It can also function as a slow, secure mobility aid moving at under 0.6 meters per second in narrow hallways. These design choices ensure genuine support without creating new risks. Importantly, Optimus processes all biometric data locally, with strict guest and private room modes that disable unnecessary monitoring. Video leaving the home is end-to-end -end encrypted and deleted after seven days by default. Energy autonomy is key to all-day usefulness. 
Optimus features a 2.3 kilowatt hour battery pack, providing enough power for 10 hours of mixed household activity. Average consumption is 200 watts, with peaks of 500 watts during heavy lifting up to 30 pounds. Integrated with Tesla Powerwall or solar systems, charging can be optimized for off-peak or surplus solar hours, raising renewable self-consumption rates from 45% to over 60% in households with 8 kilowatt solar arrays. In practice, Charging Optimus consumes only 18% of a standard 15 kilowatt hour home battery. The synergy with appliances unlocks entirely new scenarios. While cooking, Optimus can throttle induction stoves to avoid tripping a 5 kilowatt household power limit by balancing loads between stove, dryer, and EV charging. This load shifting nearly eliminates power outages from overload. On weekends, Optimus coordinates vacuuming, laundry, and dishwashing to avoid overlapping noise keeping average living room noise under 50 decibels while scheduling cycles for cheaper electricity hours. For families with children or pets, Optimus enforces safety zones, hand strength limits below 23 inches height, slowed gripping speed, and disabling high watt outlets near play areas. Kitchens require adult presence before stoves are activated, and garages remain restricted zones with progressive deterrence for children. Tesla's long-term vision is the Tesla tiny home with integrated solar panels, power wall, Matter native devices, and Optimus at its center. In this setup, Optimus can access every room within 30 seconds, coordinate energy and comfort seamlessly, and serve as an elder care or household assistant. A 6 kilowatt solar roof produces 24 kilowatt hours daily in good sunlight, enough to power the household, charge Optimus, and still store surplus. For remote areas lacking elderly care services, a tiny home plus Optimus could be a scalable solution. At an estimated Optimus cost of $10,000 to $20,000 and annual household savings of $1,200 from energy efficiency and reduced care services, payback in 15 years becomes realistic. Of course, challenges remain. Thick walls and multi-story layouts require extra mesh nodes. Low-quality IoT devices may fail compliance, needing isolation. Conflicting family habits demand adaptive compromise systems. Federated learning must ensure privacy while updating AI models. And beyond engineering, Optimus must project intent, making eye contact before moving objects, giving subtle sound cues when entering rooms and maintaining safe interpersonal distance unless invited closer. These small touches build trust in daily life. Future capabilities may include nutritional assistance by scanning food, waste, microclimate, optimization by adjusting radiant heat at individual sofas or guiding balance exercises for fall prevention in elderly residents. These incremental additions expand the utility of Optimus without undermining the core principle. The homeowner remains in control, with every decision transparent and overridable. The essence of V3.5 is not just new features, but a redefinition of the robot's role. Optimus becomes a contextual orchestrator, uniting scattered devices into a coherent system acting intelligently at the right moment and always explaining why. From saving a few percent on electricity to safeguarding elderly relatives, from efficient mornings to peaceful nights. The value lies not in lifting boxes but in understanding people well enough to help unobtrusively. When this foundation is solid, Tesla's vision of fully integrated tiny homes, where robot, energy, and smart home converge, becomes not just futuristic marketing but a practical, measurable lifestyle choice. At that point, the real question is no longer how smart and safe will your home be, but how much responsibility are you ready to share with a digital companion that truly lives alongside you? Where does Tesla Optimus's energy come from? The key point for Optimus is that the path electrons travel from the electrode to the casing is shortened, heat generation is more evenly distributed, and connection points are reduced, thereby limiting energy loss and thermal degradation when the robot exerts itself in peak power tasks such as lifting, tightening, or taking long strides. In practice, 4,680 technology has already been applied to the Cybertruck, enabling the vehicle to achieve a range of up to 500 miles with fast charging that takes only 15 to 20 minutes to reach 80% capacity. This provides owners with a longer, worry-free driving experience without the fear of running out of battery mid-journey, while also allowing Tesla to save on production costs by reducing the cost per kilowatt hour by 56% compared to the previous generation.
reaching about 55 to 60 US dollars per kilowatt hour by 2025. When the robot first appeared publicly in its early stage, the engineering team described a battery pack integrated into its body with a voltage of around 52 volts and a capacity of about 2.3 kilowatt hours. Optimus's computing platform uses the same family of self-driving computers as Tesla's vehicles, which means its capabilities in visual inference, occupancy mapping, and motion planning are directly inherited from the automotive domain. Placing a 2.3 kilowatt hour pack into an AI platform already designed to run optimally at the edge with a strict energy budget means that the definition of a full workday is not a fixed number, but rather a range of operating times depending on the task profile. In contextual power consumption estimates, when the robot is idle, it draws around 100 watts, and when moving quickly it can reach about half a kilowatt. If the work shift is dominated by light movement, observation, and moderate load grasp and release tasks, the average power draw can hover around 200 to 300 watts. At this level, 2.3 kilowatt hours translates to roughly 7 to 12 hours of operation between charges, with the 12 hour mark occurring when the task mix leans toward energy saving activities. The key point is not to treat 12 hours as a hard promise, but as a point on a spectrum achievable when hardware, software, and work organization models work together. In real-world application with Optimus Gen 3 in 2025, the 4680 battery enables the robot to operate for up to 10 continuous hours and fully recharge in just 10 minutes, allowing owners, whether factories or households, to have a robotic assistant that works for extended periods without interruption, while Tesla saves up to 43% in component costs by integrating in-house produced cells. Looking back at the starting point, Tesla built its first generation of electric vehicles on 1865 zero cells. The abundant supply from the consumer electronics ecosystem and accumulated manufacturing experience made the 1865 zero a stable foundation for the company's early models. At the time, this configuration was far from obsolete, offering adequate energy density with nickel-cobalt aluminum chemistry and a supply chain well-hardened over time, delivering roughly 11 watt-hour per cell. However, as Tesla scaled up and sought to optimize cost per kilowatt-hour, it transitioned to the 2170 cell for the Model 3 and Model Y, with each 2170 storing around 17 to 20 watt-hour, about 30% more than 18,650. Enlarging the cell's geometry went hand-in-hand -hand with refinements at the pack level, from module arrangement to cooling systems, and this accumulated know-how became the technical foundation for the next big leap. That leap came when Tesla unveiled the 4680 cell at the 2020 Battery Day event. It was not only about size but also a symbol of the philosophy of simplifying to increase margins. The tabless design reduces internal resistance, improves thermal management, allows higher current flow, and enables faster charging within the same volume. Specifically, the 4,680 stores five times more energy, about 118 watt-hour per cell, with six times the power output compared to the 2,170, while increasing energy density to 276 watt-hour per kilogram and extending electric vehicle range by 16%. The natural compatibility between the 4,680 and a humanoid robot comes from the fact that the larger cell size allows the total number of cells to be reduced requiring only about one-fifth as many as the 2,170 to achieve the same capacity, significantly reducing connection points and weight, shortening wiring, decreasing the number of welds, and minimizing parasitic resistance. The tabless design shortens the current's path, improving heat distribution so that every joule released goes into actuators instead of being wasted as heat. In a limb system with multiple actuators, Every millisecond of reduced latency and every percentage point of voltage drop avoided translates into smoother and more precise motion, while also reducing control noise that the AI must compensate for. The structural pack architecture turns the battery block into a load-bearing component, cutting down on non-functional materials and mass. A lighter Optimus by several kilograms will have lower locomotion costs both mechanically and energetically, while also improving safety when interacting closely with humans in confined spaces. In practical application, this gives owners a safer robot experience with reduced weight and higher rigidity, 
while allowing Tesla to save 69% in production capital investment thanks to the dry electrode process, which reduces manufacturing space and energy usage by up to tenfold. From an AI perspective, every working hour of Optimus is the result of three layers of optimization. At the perception layer, vision networks and occupancy maps learn to see just enough so as not to waste computation on irrelevant details. At the planning and control layer, algorithms optimize trajectories, reduce vibration, and choose stable static poses so that foot and hand placements require the least possible energy. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.